Hi ladies, it's Hannah with Let's Talk Plus Size. So today I have a product review and as you can tell by the title, it is a product review of the Glamouflage, oh excuse my nails, <laughs> the Glamouflage um, Heavy Duty Concealer. And you guys have most likely heard of this, this is pretty popular, um, but I just, I have a list right here of some pros and cons about the Glamouflage concealer, um, so if you guys want to hear more about this concealer, then just keep on watching. So I'll start with the pros first. Um, the first one that I have on my list is the price. I believe this is only um, $5.99, and <clears throat> for a heavy duty concealer that works this well, whale <laughs> that works this well is um I don't know it's just crazy that I can get this for $5.99 um which brings me to my next point there's a lot of products in here um there is I believe I think it says 0.71 ounces so if you compare this to a foundation like this I have the dream liquid mousse um, this has one fluid ounce, so this is one, or point seven one. um, and for this you only use a little bit. Um, I've had this for about a month and a half now, and, um, there's still a lot of product in there. Um, when I squeeze it like this, I can't squeeze it too much because there's still so much product in there. Um, so yeah, it comes with a lot of product. When I use it for under my eyes... I literally use about, let me twist the cat back on there, about this much. And what I do is I'll take a little bit on it like a concealer brush, or I'll use a foundation brush if I'm not going to be using as much product, and I'll just kind of like, kind of pack it on there, or not pack it on, but kind of dot it, and then take my ring finger. And kind of blend it in. But you need to be careful because under your eyes is very sensitive. Um, but as you can tell right now, I don't have any makeup on. Because I it's like right before I go to sleep. So, um, yeah. It works really, really well for covering um, under eye circles. <clears throat> you can even use this for spot treatments. Like for blemishes or anything like that. Um, also on the package it said that you can use this for tattoo like covering tattoos I don't have any tattoos seeing as I'm only 15 um, but I've heard that it does work well with the actual um, concealer came this hard candy concealer pencil and I have never seen anything like this um, but it's pretty cool see I've, I've used a lot of it or not a lot of it but it's pretty cool. Um, see if I can get a little bit on my hand here because it's kind of short. Um, you're not going to be able to see that that well because it is kind of my skin tone. Here you go. And then it blends really easily. So that's really cool. I would use this more for like a spot treatment. Um, but what you're supposed to use it for is like kind of outlining your tattoo and then you fill it in with the Glamouflage. Um, the next thing on here is the coverage. Like I said, the coverage on this thing is amazing. I have, um, really bad under eye circles just because, um, my allergies are so bad that my eyes kind of water all the time. Um, so that causes my eyes to be very puffy, very dark, um, which causes, you know, wrinkles under my eyes like I have. So, um... Having this heavy duty concealer really helps out a lot. I actually used this in my last video which was an updated foundation routine. Um, on there I used a lot of it. I didn't mean to use that much. Um, but as you could tell it's very heavy duty if you want to go back and look at that. Um, I kind of did one eye and then pointed and I didn't have the other eye done and you could definitely tell a huge difference. Um, and if you set this with the right powder, you do not see any fine lines, which is a very another um, important point for me because I do have wrinkles under my eyes from my eyes being swollen um, a lot. So it's very good that it doesn't show um, fine lines. There is a 
I believe it's Kat Von D concealer that's very expensive um, that a lot of people see this as a dupe for. Um, so yeah. Then on to cons. Um, one of the main cons for me is the co like the colors that you could choose from. There's only three. I have this in light. And this is the lightest one that you can get. They have like light, medium, and tan or something like that. Um, and when I saw this, I thought it was going to be perfect for under my eyes. Um, but it's very, very, very light. I wish I would have gone to the um, middle one. But the thing is, like with concealers and things, I'm usually a very light color just because obviously... I'm really white um so honestly you know if you are the color of like snow then you might want to pick this color but I'm very white and this is still really light for me so um the next time I purchase this because I know I will definitely repurchase this once this um is done I will get a dark a darker color and then the last con on here is um, that it's only available at Walmart. This is hard candy. And as you guys know, hard candy is only available at Walmart. Um, they were a more high-end um, makeup brand. But um, they kind of stopped making it. I guess they something happened. They, were, they weren't making enough money or something. And then they kind of relaunched back into Walmart. Um, so I don't know about you guys, but I never go to Walmart. I normally go to Target just because Target is right across the street from me. Um, so once in a blue moon, if I go to Target, I mean Walmart, I'll see hard candy. I love hard candy. I just, I never have, um, it's never available to me. So, um... That's basically it for this glamouflage. I love this stuff. Definitely, definitely recommend it. Um, especially if you have under eye circles. But like I said, this is also great for blemish um, covering. If you have um, pretty bad blemishes or scarring, especially scarring. Um, so yeah, if you guys have any questions, leave it in the down bar. And I will try to get back to you. Thanks. Bye.